Now I want to show you how Excel can be used to find the averages of a bunch of list of numbers. Uh, let me make sure these are all the same size here. There we go. So here I have three lists, D, E, F. And I typed in the word mean and median just so I can organize so that I can look across and know that in this space is going to go the mean average of this list. So here's how we do it. Click where you want the mean to end up and double click because we're going to type in this cell. So I'm going to start typing in equals. Now Excel knows how to do average, especially knows how to do mean average. Because mean average is used so much, they just call it the average. So I'm going to start typing in the word average, A-V-E-R-A-G-E. -E. And it shows up. Yeah, I recognize this, that it's the average. So it's going to do the average. The average of what? I need to put parentheses, so I'm going to put one parenthesis, and it starts asking for which number, which number, which number. Numbers on Excel are identified by the letter and the number that it lines up with. This number is D1, D2, D3. Well, I want all of these. So what's a fast way to get all of them? A fast way is to click hold, click and hold at the top of your list, drag down to the bottom of your list and let go. And notice it'll take the top D1 the whole way through the bottom D10. That's my list of numbers it's going to mean average. Put your closed parenthesis to finish out the expression and hit enter. The average of this list, the mean average, is 44. I want to repeat this process. So I could go to the next one and start typing in equals average and put parentheses. But there is a faster way. Excel gets really smart with this. This box represents how to calculate the mean average. So watch what I'm going to do. I'm going to click on that box, right click, copy, go to the next box, right click, paste, and look what it does. It's that smart that it will automatically find the, the same calculation but with the numbers that it is below. So what's my mean, mean average of this list? 48. I'm going to click in this box, right click and paste, and guess what? There are my three averages. So once you write your formula, you don't have to keep writing it. You can just copy and paste it. So here are my three mean averages. Okay, let's do the same idea with median. Hit equals, and this one, I don't type the word average, I type the word median. Phone's ringing, I'm going to pause real quick. Okay, so let's pick up the phone rang and I left. So now let's type in our formula for median. It is equal sign, and then spell out the word median, M-E-D-I-A-N. Parenthesis. Again, I'm going to select the same numbers, click and hold, drag down, release. That is my list of list D, parenthesis, enter, and guess what? There's my median. I can take this, copy it, paste it, whoops, cancel, right click and paste, right click and paste, and at the bottom of each column, I have what I want. I have my mean average, my median, my mean average, my median, my mean average, my median. I could do the same for mode if I wanted to, or range, but that's the general gist of how to work those things.